Question number seven, Chris Bishop. Oh, thank you, Mr Speaker. My question is to the Minister of Revenue. What progress has been made on the government's investment property tax reforms announced as part of Budget 2015? Mr. Speaker. The Honourable Todd McClay. Mr. Speaker, last week the government passed the Bright Line legislation, which is an important tool to ensure property speculators pay their fair share of tax. The new Bright Line test requires income tax to be paid on any gains from residential properties purchased on or after the 1st of October and sold within a two year period, with the exception of the owner's main home, inherited property, and transfers of uh, relationship property. Mr Speaker, the Bright Line test is just one part of the government's approach to tightening the property investment rules. Supplementary. Supplementary question, Chris Bishop. Thank you, Mr Speaker. Supplementary question, how is the government ensuring investors pay their fair share of tax? Mr Speaker. The Honourable Todd McClay. Mr Speaker, the Bright Line measures, together with rules requiring buyers and sellers to provide an IAD number, and non-residents to also provide their foreign tax identity number and a New Zealand bank account will help Inland Revenue to better identify investors in New Zealand's residential property market. Inland Revenue will be watching transactions and will enforce income tax rules on those who might try to avoid their obligations outside of the two-year period. The government provided IRD with $29 million extra funding in Budget 2015 to focus on property tax compliance. This will take uh, Inland Revenue's total budget for work in this area uh, over the next five years to $62 million, which is expected to generate an additional $420 million of tax revenue. Supplementary, Mr Speaker. Supplementary question, Chris Bishop. Thank you, Mr Speaker. How will a residential land withholding tax support the Bright Line test? Mr Speaker. The Honourable Todd McClay. Mr Speaker, yesterday I introduced a tax bill which proposes a new withholding tax on sales of residential property by people who live overseas and go on to sell that property within the two-year period of their purchase. This tax will act as a collection mechanism for the Bright Line test. The proposed residential land withholding tax will ensure that the integrity of the tax system uh, and it will bring the collection of the Bright Line tax into line with other whole withholding regimes. This proposal, together with the new Bright Line test and changes uh, to collect uh, ta better tax information about buyers and sellers of residential property, will help to ensure that everybody pays their fair share of tax on gains from property sales. Question number eight. The right Speaker, this question is 